Hello everybody, today I'm going to teach you how to solve the parity error on the Rubik's Void Cube. And, um, it has to do with the corners, like you also get a corner parity on the 4x4, but it's not the same algorithm on here, it's different on this. Now we all know on the, on the regular 3x3, we can, we can either have 0 placed correctly, 1 placed correctly, or 4 placed correctly. But on this scenario, on my cube, um, let me see here. Find mine. This corner here is placed correctly, while this one over here is also is also placed correctly. The one with the void logo on it. So again, these two corners are placed correctly, while these two, while um these two here, these two corners here need to be switched with each other. So here now, I'm going to teach you the algorithm to do this. This is a long. This is kind of a long algorithm, but bear with me. It's going to be F. L R prime B a two U a D prime another F U L prime U prime L R prime D prime F prime and then an R prime, and then rotate the cube over. And there you go. Um, your first layer, first and second layers are maintained. The only the, the only difference you see is that you have maintained, you preserved your cross, but you kind of broke up the alignment a little bit. So with just a quick fixing of this, um, your with this just a quick fixing of the cross, the parity will be solved, and you can solve it just like, and then you can solve the rest of the cube like a three by three, and then you're done.